Hi, I'm Carrie Goldring with the Divorce Lending Association. And today I'm with Ryan, who helps me with people who need credit repair when we're trying to get mortgage approval. And Ryan, I wanted you to introduce yourself and tell everyone a little bit about what you do. Hi, guys. My name is Ryan Barouche, and um, my company is called American Credit Restoration. And I've been helping people to improve their credit uh, for almost 20 years now. And uh, we're located in Southfield, Michigan. And um, yeah, so basically um, what we do is we help people to uh, remove all kinds of negative accounts that are hurting the credit score. So this could be um, collection accounts, charge-offs, late payments. Um, you know, we see a lot of medical bills on there, uh, maybe cell phone bills, any, anything that's negative is kind of what we go after. That's perfect. And then when you help people, I mean, I, I'm a, I know when I give you people to, it's normally I give your phone number and then they call you. Mm -hmm. Are you using a credit report they already have? Are you pulling a new oh, one? Yeah. It, no, if they have one already, um, that's the easiest way for me to look at it, and, you know, avoiding an inquiry. Uh, we never pull it as a hard inquiry. So um, a lot of our clients are on Credit Karma or Experian, like a credit monitoring site like that. So we can log in there and look at it uh, pretty easily also. Okay. And then are you going line by line explaining what someone needs to do and saying, yeah. well, I can write a letter to you for this or? Yeah. So when I look at a credit report, I kind of audit it and I, I look over each account and I try to figure out, is that account helping their credit score or hurting your score? Um, you know, if, if um, a lot of times we see people who uh, maybe have a credit card that's in good standing, but the utilization is too high. So, um, you know, the rule of thumb is to be under 30% utilization on each card. But, uh, but really, in my opinion, you want to be around 10% or less, because even at 30%, you're, you're going to be losing points. Um, so if you're trying to maximize your score, you really got to be at 10%. Um, so that's, that's a big thing. And then um, as far as the negative accounts, yeah, some of them are going to be things that can be removed pretty easily through disputes. Um, other accounts are going to be things that are difficult or very unlikely to come off of there. Um, so, you know, if it's something that can be removed through a dispute, I'll, I'll let the client know. If it's something that um, it's probably not going to come off, that should be settled. I'll, I'll, I can, uh, you know, advise them about how to settle it and maybe do a pay for deletion also. And then if there's letters that need to be written, you pretty much have all your standard letters already done. Yeah, yep. Everything, you know, just has to be kind of uh, customized to fit their situation. But, um, but yeah. And then talk, talk to me real quick about, I know sometimes you were telling me that things come back to the customer in the mail and then everybody thinks it's junk mail and they throw it out. Yes. So there's a couple, that's a good point. So yeah. So sometimes, okay, when we dispute something, uh, the creditor might send a letter in the mail saying, hey, this has been disputed. You know, sometimes they want you to provide more documentation to support the dispute. Um, I often tell my clients, don't respond to them. You don't want to give them any information that's going to help them to validate the account and, and verify that everything's accurate. So usually ignore that. But, um, you know, they will also get letters from the credit bureaus, like TransUnion, Experian, and Equifax. And um, those letters that you get back is helpful for me to see because then I can see the results and what's been removed and uh, I'll know what I have to keep on working on also. Wonderful. Well, thank you for explaining all that. I think people are going to find this very helpful. If anyone wants to get a hold of you directly, what's the best way to find you? Yeah, so um, I'm in Southfield. My phone number is 248-799-9441. That's um, the easiest way. Or my website is AmericanCreditCleaners.com. And uh, that's probably, yeah, you can leave a message on there also. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for your time. I think this was really helpful. Of course. Thank you so much for having me. Mm -hmm.